Let's see what's going on with the gang. Can you spell yes. drought? Drought. <clears throat> Come on. D R yeah. O. Okay. I said T. T? <laughs> no. Yeah, you missed a lot of things. Yo, it's your no. boy, H.P. Lotus Sauce, Harry Pinero, but to you, it's Mr. Pinero. Welcome back to another series on Wiresting Class. Now, three students have been helping. You better keep them tight. And I have one last chance to redeem them. But before we get into it, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and click that notification bell so you're notified for Channel 4.0. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. okay. Do they do so good with these intros every time? Worse than your mother. To my Haven't seen Manrique, bro. You so I wonder if they have like, I think they have like, they gotta have like seasons or something that they do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know what it is, but something gotta be going on. Cause like now we're starting to see Manrique and stuff. We're starting to see fucking, uh, what's her name? Uh, Joyce and a lot of stuff too. Like this is getting crazy. So I wonder if that's what it was. Like enough time just had to pass by to where their contracts were, uh, came on or something. I don't know. Dave Blunts? Oh, all right. We got to check out some cube today? tonight. Uh, I was getting a massage from my head of year. What? And apparently that was frowned upon. He doesn't get fired, but I get detention. I think you should move on. Yes! Okay, Manrika, obviously your new hair. What brings you to Mr. Pinero's detention? I hit everyone's shoes in the PE changing room, sir. In English? I hit everyone's shoes in the PE changing ah, room, sir. Rum accent. <laughs> all right. Oh, oh, my God. Patron. I was kissing. Was it a good one? It was nice and long and sloppy. Hey! Oh, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Who was that? For me. Today's subject in the classroom is geography. Manrika, talk to me. Geography, does it ring a bell? No. What's the capital of Birmingham? There is no capital of Birmingham. <laughs> trick question. Yes, trick question, of course. Of course. Oh, I would have totally country. guessed something. Not English, please, seriously. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, it's gonna be a long day. Yeah, it's gonna be a long day. I hope you're aware and ready for it. Well, enough of the waffle. It's time for round one. Okay, students, this is the quick fire round. Like a... I said quick fire round. I said quick fire round. Okay, I said... question one. What is the capital of Iraq? Birmingham. Yeah. Okay, okay. We pray for you. It is Baghdad. It's Baghdad! That's correct. Baghdad. Y'all better claim her, bro. Y'all better claim her, because even I could have got that right. Dad, I got bagged. Yep, no, because I bagged dads. So, like... What does he... What does he mean by that, exactly? No, I don't, not for me. No, I'm talking about, like... That's how you feel. Nah, nah, that's how you feel. Move the fuck on, bro. Whoa. <laughs> I will. What is this? Man, Come on. Go on. It's the caves from the film Richie oh. Rich. Oh my. Oh my. What? You know, you know where he goes it. and it's where the secret vault is. That's the caves from Richie Rich. How world. dare you disrespect that's America? That's where it is. That is absolutely incorrect. Oh. Adiola, you want to go? Adiola. The Rock of Five Faces. <laughs> Hey, you know what's crazy? Oh. It's full there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Rock of Five Faces. <laughs> yeah, that's good, man. Uh, that is Mount Rushmore. That is Mount Rushmore. Oh, thank God justice. America's getting what some respect around here. It's given to a volcano that has never erupted. Now what similarities? Oh. Lads. <laughs> I don't know, innit? <laughs> <laughs> but it's called a... Virgin Volcano. What? I was going to say Virgin as well, I swear to God. But um, I got another one. Manrique, who's next? I was going to say Dormant. I was going to say Dormant as well. So they said both Martin. That's what happens okay, when so it just is, in, is um, not, is not exploding. Never erupted. Yeah. I'm Martin. That's essentially what it, that, no, that's essentially <laughs> what it is. That's fair. I mean, I would take that. Oh, what is the imaginary How could it be extinct if it never erupted? That doesn't even make sense. And the South Pole. Go on, Adela. It's imaginary. So it can be whatever I want it to be. I'm bald, bro. Can't Sorry. It. Okay, so imagine it now. Mm, I think it is called Antarctic. Antar oh, she got it. Antarctic. She got it. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Love. Can I go? Um, yeah, Manrika. Oh. Santa's got her. What? She Santa's, Santa's, uh, Santa's, Santa's Grotto? Grotto? 
Okay, right. Barbara, can, can we focus on our good qualities? She's yeah, yeah. very nice, very nice person. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, what? Uh, Pretty? That's all I yeah. got. Yeah. I'm, yeah. And, and if I'm going to be honest, I'm not even that. Uh, you I'm can not. save us here. Okay. You really can. Magnetic balls. Okay, this morning when you woke up, put your uniform on and came to this place, what did you think was going to happen today? Did you think he was going to get things right? No, okay, I'm sorry. They definitely please, didn't. Please, please. None of them thought that. Sorry. It's wrong. It's the Prime Meridian. Oh, duh. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, duh. Okay. Yeah. On everything I love. Yeah. Without those pieces of paper, you are shit. What? <laughs> Give them to us and let's ask you those questions. And see no. No. What is no. this image? Manrika. What even uh, is that? The Angel of the North, Newcastle, something. Oh, my God. She got it. I couldn't well even see done. it. Well done. It looks like a well, like a plane. How did you get that? Ain't that Jesus? I got Nobody cares. Oh. <sighs> what is this flag? Adiola. It's a medical. No, it's a medical <laughs> emergency. Let's <laughs> go. Cool. Sweden. Oh my! God. As, no. she, as she says it so innocently. Sweden. Oh what? <laughs> uh, Switzerland. That is correct. Oh. So that is the end of the question that round, a... and the winner Wait. is. <laughs> well done, Darkest Man. No, nah, that wasn't even I'm close to fair. Sure. Thank you, bro. It's now time for the second round. Welcome to Mr. Pinero's oh, spelling God. bee. You must spell the word. And this is when it goes point. downhill. Now, if you guess what the word means, you get another point. Of course, that's two points per word. Okay. Are you ready? I said, I said, R. You ready? Uh -huh. I said, R. You ready? Yeah. All right, Adiola, it's time for you to step up. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, Adiola. Yes. Can you spell? Yes. Drought. Drought. <clears throat> Big D. D. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Cooking. You, what? I said T. <laughs> Did I miss something? Yeah, it's my people, bro. Damn, I was, it's, you know when you can't see the letters? It's like hard to even <laughs> see the letters. <laughs> so, you got that wrong. Um, the I really don't know. Drought. So, a drought is when. No way. It's dry and there's no more. And it's the drought, like a drought. <laughs> she did not just use drought to explain drought. Like, there's a drought. Like, you know when someone's like, oh yeah, there's so a drought. The like, definition... There's no more water. There's no more water. But I know what you were trying to say. So you get one point, all right? Thank you. All right, second word. <gasps> Can you spell the word plateau? This is the third word. P-L-A. Now she doesn't want to say T. This is the bit you're struggling with. Tio. Lato. Okay, and that is incorrect. Oh. All right, can you define plateau for me, please? Is it like where you put stuff on the, on the plate and there's just loads of different mixes? What? Plateau is French for plate. I thought it was <laughs> an area of... No, bro, no. <laughs> No, bro, no way. Like, she's not, I just, oh my God. How has she made it through life? Like, how has she made it through life? Fairly level high ground. <laughs> okay, fair. You actually got one point. Okay, Manrika, your first word is epicenter. E P I C E N T R E. Cooker. That is cooker. She's a cooker. <laughs> Epicenter. Can you define what epicenter means? It is the center where you get epipens from. That's exactly what I was going to say. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I swear, bro. It's where you get where you get all the epicenter. Epi they've got to be somewhere that they keep them, so it's got to be an epicenter. Hospitals. You know what I mean? There's probably an epicenter in every hospital, and that's where you go and get the epipens. I'm not oh, a doctor. Come I don't know. On, dude. No, we know because if you was a doctor, there would be a Netflix the series about the you. Earth, a lot dude. Of it's the point of the Earth's surface directly above the point where an earthquake originates. Well, say, say the exact word for word what you just said right now. It's the point of the Earth's surface. <laughs> 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 All right. So Taking the piss today. Point. Can you spell tsunami? T. Good girl. S. Come Good on. U. Yeah. Supporting. Come N on, don't overthink it. Yeah. I. Okay. M. M. I. There we go. That is correct. Cooker. Tsunami. Tsunami. It is the well center done. of the earth. Yes, so I can tell you what it means. Yes, I can tell you what it means. Okay, go ahead. Not the center of the earth. Uh, it's the, the center of the earth. Shut up, faggots. 
<laughs> oh, my life. She's not lying, though. No. She's not lying. It, that's not the scientific okay. thing. That's she's and not it lying. All right. out everything. I've seen All them right. films. I'm actually going to give you that point. So you're currently on what? three points, but I'm going to give the uh, proper explanation. Tsunami is a long, high sea wave caused by an earthquake or How other dare disturbances. You clip that? You've done really well. You got three points, which puts you in the lead at this precise moment. How do you feel about that? Uh, ah! It's now time for the darkest man to step up on the plate. Go on, Go darkest. Oh, Lord have mercy. Go darkest. Go darkest. Hey. Go darkest. Hey. Go darkest. Hey. Go darkest. Hey. Can you spell Antipodes? A N T I P P E D E S. Damn. <laughs> I should have done a hit correct. that. Correct. It is actually A N T I P O D E S. Oh, I said P P E D S. In, in, define the word Antipodes. It's a piece of land that's. But I didn't think. That's just covered with trees. I mean, technically, no. The answer actually is so any pair of points on the Earth's surface that are diametrically opposite to each other. Like so, Arsenal and Chelsea, pretty much. Well done. Yeah. Good enough you. Can you spell archipelago? How are we giving that to you? H P I L E A G O. <laughs> yeah, I was wrong. Yeah, the fact that you already start looking over there. All right, can you define the word? How, how would anyone define it? It's essentially a compass. Um to sort of direct you for life. It makes great it makes great decisions for you. What do I eat, archipelago? Morley's. Well, it's neither of, uh, any of these. those, actually. Yeah. Um, definitions. It's a chain, cluster, or collection of islands. For example, Hawaii. So, Dark so is that what you're supposed to be? No worries, man. I got you. The winner of the spelling bee is the one and only Manrika. Deserved. Well done, Manrika. Deserved. Okay, students. She kind of snapped. It's now time for the final round where you three go against my star student. Now, Manrika and Darkest, you have one gold star. And of course, the aim is to finish with as many or more. Uh oh. You're saying, sir, sorry. Yeah. As many or more. <laughs> as many or more gold stars. They're my star student of the week. Currently, Manrika and Darkish, you both have one gold star. And Adiola, you have zero. Get your it's money up, not your funny up, bro. It's now time for the one and only Emiliana! Oh, they're screwed. There you are, Oh, they're five. screwed. How you feeling? I'm good. You feeling good? Yeah. Emiliano, they have some questions for you. Darkest. Who's your, who's your favorite YouTuber? Probably my favorite would be... Harry Pinero! Oh. And look, Emiliano, she it's okay. Yeah, I'll for you sometimes. She said no it's so fast. Fine. Who's your favorite music I mean, artist? technically, you can't really count Olivia that. Rodrigo. Oh, 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 she's the one that made, um... Rain... What about driving past your house? Oh, oh, oh. Oh. What is your favorite subject? What? I love drama. Oh my gosh, same. Yeah, it's he my got favorite. It, Susan. <gasps> doctor, help me. I can't help you, but if I didn't doctor. Oh yeah, everyone's dying. Yeah, brother. That hospital is called, come here, you die. Come okay, here and die. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> All right. Question one goes like this. Oh. Which fast food has become a recent tradition for Christmas meals in Japan? Three, two, oh, KFC, one, please right? your answers. Okay. <laughs> You've gone with Wagamama. Yeah, I would eat that on Christmas Day. I went, I went with Nando's. I, I want to know your explanation for that. <laughs> Honestly, but there is none. Yeah. Yeah, you said restaurant, Nando's. Just keep it quiet. Look, okay, um, okay. so, Emiliana, if you don't mind, after three, one, two, three. Okay. Oh, oh, I swear to God! I Got him. Got him. And then I change it to Nando's. Well, the answer is KFC. Oh, I, mean, I told you, boys. There that. we go. Which actor plays Tommy Shelby in the hit series, Peaky Blinders. You're confident. I run Birmingham. If I didn't know this, yeah. I would get banished from Birmingham, which would actually be quite a good thing. One, two, three. Okay. No, but I'm on. There, there's some cahoots going on. What does your say? Bugs and Malone. <laughs> Bugs and Malone, four. man. Oh, I thought he said four or something. I was when like, what? Peaky Blinders. Where did you see Bugsy? I heard his fire in the booth once. In yeah. Episode, episode, season one, episode six, I believe. Killian Murphy. How did you get that? 
Yeah. Well, when you actually watch the show, yeah. the credits at the end. We've looked at the footage and we can see that you copied Manrico. We Co sit No, because you lot are always trying to get me to look like, oh, I can never get the answer I mean, right. Works. I wonder why that is. Emiliana, please reveal and say your answer. Killian Murphy. Killian Murphy. Now, is that the answer? Of course it's the answer. Killian Murphy, of course. We got... There we go, gold star. What is amphophobia the fear of? One, two, three. <laughs> Uh, explain. Yeah, so basically, there's some people out there that are scared of numbers. Mm. So anthrophobia sounds like I'm scared of 26. Because I met a girl who's scared of the number 13 once. Do you see what I have to deal with though? Like genuinely. That's crazy. Like, what's that? Like people, people have a fear of like people ch ch making loud chewing sounds, and I feel like I might have read it somewhere. Um, <laughs> Adiola. <laughs> it had the word ant in it. That's fair, Miliana. One, two, three. Flowers. Flowers. Oh. That didn't work. That's correct! Damn! It is flowers. Okay, none of you were able to beat my star student, so we're gonna go into a head to head to head to find out who is the worst in class. Okay, so where in the UK was Cadbury founded? Adiola. Manchester. No. Birmingham. That is correct. It is Birmingham. The world is. Birmingham. Darkis, you are safe. So, Adiola and Manrika, yes. it's between you two. Woo! The question is, Woo! what is the only country that borders the United Kingdom? Adiola. Ireland. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. That is. Oh my. Correct. That yes! is correct. Adiola. Yes! It is yes! Ireland. It yes! is Ireland. So, Manrika, you started off so well, but you finished off so bad. So you are the worst in class, and you will be facing punishment. Yeah, Darkest I think probably Adiola, still be good, because once you Anna, wait for everything to get up, time. Be great. Let's get into the punishment. OK, students. Bring back the ear. It is now time we're gonna roast for the roast her. of roast. Manrika. Emiliana, if you don't mind, placing the hat where it belongs. There, oh yeah, there we go. Take it away. Man, Rika, you're so dumb. Mm. Your brain is the size of a breadcrumb. Oh, a breadcrumb. That's how we're starting, though. Darkest, you want to say something? All right, Man, Rika. Uh. When I first heard you speak, I wanted to turn off the man speaker. Oh, oh. no. You should have just sat there and listened to the man teacher. Oh, no. You ain't got a boyfriend because you ain't a man keeper. Oh. Man, Hold Rika. The fuck up. Yeah. When I saw ya, yeah. uh. I had to say, yeah. Bah. Yeah. Okay. Get her out. Yeah. Okay. Um, that's that's. I mean. This is. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Anything I else think we just end that yeah. right there. Yeah. You look so funny. You can never be anybody's honey. Oh. Okay. Okay. Got him. She came back with it though. Today, I was gonna follow you. You open up that snack mouth. That breath smells horrible. Oh. <laughs> You got roasted! The last date you went on, you got ghosted. Oh. oh. That might have been you too got deep. Roasted. You got burnt like bread. That's toasted. <laughs> All right, my name's been Harry. He Pinero. didn't want to stop. This he didn't want to stop. This is been the Emiliano, darkest man, Adiola Patron, and the one and only Manrika. Now, if you've enjoyed this, you know what you need to do. Like, comment, and subscribe, and click that notification bell so you're notified when Channel 4 points upload. I should have turned it to Manrix. Uh, came on Channel 4 set smelling like last week. Oh! oh bro, please. End it, end okay, it. I got seven no, more. End it, end it. I got seven more. No, it's done. It's done. So, what are you doing? Yeah, how's your daughter? Oh. oh. Wait, wait, wait. No, no. Yo, come and sit here. It's fine. Oh. I'm still waiting on her Insta still. Oh, oh my no, God. No. No. Specs. Oh, my God. Specs, specs, specs. 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 <laughs> after school, after school. Say that. After, after school. school, you watch. It's after fine. school, say that. Nah, that's going to be great, bro. That's going to be so good.